What's up guys and welcome back to Dieter Plays. I've got the latest here in Roblox news so let's just get started right away. We've got some leaks, we've got some cool stuff, some games and some updates that are happening so we're going to get right into it. Uh, we've got some things here that have popped up in the leaks catalog. We're going to take a closer look. Looks like we've got a fedora, we've got some Halloween themed stuff as well. Let's take a little closer look at this. Looks like we've got a bait bucket which is coming soon. A back accessory. So it looks like it's going to be a little back accessory bait bucket thing. I can see some some other outfits that this might go good with as well so it looks like a little chum bucket and it's got some sort of little uh, tentacle sticking out of it but also some slime so uh, maybe it's a mutant uh, it could be a mutant uh, octopus or something now we've got this right here the Mexican fedora I know a lot of you guys have been asking when's the Mexico one gonna come out when's the UK one gonna come out there's a whole bunch of them that a lot of you guys are asking about but it looks like the Mexican one is coming out very soon I think Independence Day for Mexico is like mid-September so maybe this one's a little bit behind I'm guessing this one will come out very soon in the catalog and as as always it's gonna be free all of those fedoras are free and I will be sure to let you guys know and have a link in the description of a video when that actually does come out and it's available for you guys so the next thing here we've got the fancy black cat head okay it's fancy I guess a monocle makes something fancy and so does a bow tie so if you guys want to dress as a cat we've got that really creepy cat that we got last year during the Halloween event and that one's just a little too creepy this one's far more sophisticated than that one over here the cute spooky witch hat not that spooky it just looks like somebody dropped their ice cream though because they found an eyeball in it I would do the same thing like if I had an ice cream cone had an eyeball in it I would totally drop it but uh, it became a hat Nice. Uh, this is an interesting little combination of things. That one should be coming out pretty soon. As you can see, most of these are Halloween themed. Probably just going to hit the catalog and then cost Robux. Hopefully, maybe they'll give a promo code for something. I'm not sure. They've been doing this Llama of the Week thing. This is the third Llama. This is the Wee Witch Llama. So this one will be coming out very soon. It's got huge air ears. And uh, I think these are just shoulder accessories. So, yeah, you can actually... This would be a good good little combination if you got something that's kind of a, a purple theme for your outfit. Uh, next one over here... Uh, Another cat mask, except this one right here is a little bit, this one's pretty fancy too as well, it's a masquerade cat mask, so uh, apparently your eyes will kind of show through the holes. This could be really weird looking depending on the kind of eyes that people choose to wear with this one, so I can't wait to try this one on actually, I, I, I kind of want to see how it's going to look. Now this thing, I have no idea, it's a shoulder accessory, looks like an owl, but with like a, a watermelon or pickle mouth and a pumpkin head. It's a pumpkin bird jack-o-lantern. Really confused about what this whole thing is but okay I like creepy it's good it's creepy for Halloween that's what we like now on the catalog not much new here we do have some new hair made by Dysoft and it looks like we've got a new UGC person right here that we can uh, that is starting to make some UGC items named Builder Boy and speaking of what they've got here Picklehead let's take a, a close look at this here the Picklehead now I can turn myself into a Pickle Roblox you guys know it's Pickle Rick Nice. So I can't wait to see the outfits people are going to come up with for this one as well. They're going to have full, like, pickle clothes, and they're just going to be in here. Everyone's going to be running around like, I'm Pickle Rick. It's going to be hilarious. So I am I think that's kind of a funny one, and I'm looking forward to seeing what people come up with the, with the full outfits there. So this is Builder Boy. He looks like he's wearing his pickle outfit and a little green shirt, but he could definitely get more pickly going on in there. But uh, a pretty nice outfit, and congratulations to Builder Boy for making it onto the UG UGC team. Uh, in order to get on the UGC team, I'm not sure you have to be a pretty well-known user. I think it's invite only from Roblox, and there's only a couple people that are allowed to do it at this point, and I'm not sure when they're going to start expanding that even more, or if there even will be a point where everyone in the public will be able to upload UGC items. So we're going to see. It's still evolving, and I will keep you guys updated about that. We also have a new updated feature here in Roblox. If you go to settings, and you go over to billing, uh, there's this new feature. Now, you know how if you get like a Robux card and it actually just gives you a currency and then you uh, try to exchange that for Robux and then there's still some left over you know sometimes there's just a couple cents like I have two cents here now what you can do is you go if you go into the billing part you can convert that into Robux so even small amounts so like basically two cents is two Robux so it sounds like one penny per Robux we can redeem that and then you can get rid of that extra balance that you don't need and then you'll get your extra couple Robux as a part of that so if you guys have some extra balance there in your Roblox credit and you want to convert those to Robux you can do that now super easy now 
congratulations to Jailbreak for hitting 3 billion visits. This is very, very cool. This is the second game in Roblox that has actually achieved this, uh, this goal and this feat. So now if you go in there just for this week in Jailbreak, um, you can go and go to one of those machines and use the code 3 billion party and then you can get a limited set of tire decals that say like 3 billion visits on it so if you want to get those you got to do that because it says it's valid this week only so congratulations to those guys Badimo, BadCC and Asimo on 3 billion visits if you guys are wondering the other game that has achieved that it was Meep City Meep City at this point is at 4.2 billion visits right now so they're going to hit 5 billion visits at some point that will be a pretty awesome achievement we'll see if if jailbreak ends up passing them uh, fairly soon after that we're, we're, we'll see because this is a very very popular one and it's still getting a lot of visits let's see right now we've got 28,000 playing meep city we've got 18,000 playing jailbreak so jailbreak's gonna need some massive updates if it wants to get up there and get caught up to meep city so the next thing we've got here if you haven't noticed a new game is on the popular list and it's number one right now the second floor added to Restaurant Tycoon 2. Like, Restaurant Tycoon 1 was a pretty popular game. It's also on top rated right now. So this game right here, made by Ultra, it's kind of interesting that this is a, a brand new game, a tycoon game. So you guys might want to go and check it out. I've played it for just a little bit. Uh, definitely feels like a, a tycoon to me. So that's kind of interesting that we've got the tycoons that are starting to take the front of the list. And let's see how long this one can actually hold the spot on the top of the list or if it's going to end up kind of drifting down the line, sort of like the simulators are. Except, I don't know, Beast Swarm Simulator doing really, really good. They really revived that game, and they're right here in number six. So congratulations to those guys as well. If you want me to make some more Beast Swarm Simulator videos, let me know. I haven't really played it in a long time, but maybe you guys can help me get up to date. Uh, one last thing we're going to just kind of note here. This weekend is another update to Lumion Legacy. They did half of the update last weekend on the 5th, and now here on on the 12th they're going to do a new update we're going to get up to the top we're going to get to the pagoda we're going to figure out why everybody is corrupted and then we're going to make our way to brimber city and whatever there is in between we're going to battle at the second uh the second battle theater and uh probably find some Dulumian. so we are going to cover that here on this channel make sure you watch the stream tomorrow when we stream that and then this weekend we're going to make a bunch of videos to get you guys updated on all the latest and greatest in that game well that is all for the roblox news for today if you guys are new here would love to have you subscribe and hit that notification so I can keep you guys updated and that you can come and join during some of these live streams and enjoy some of the fun with us. Uh, thank you so much for watching and we will talk to you guys later.